I'll be reviewing Baked Alaska from the New Orleans Ice Cream Company. A few years ago, Ben & Jerry's had a flavor called Baked Alaska. However, it had nothing to do with the Baked Alaska dessert. It was vanilla ice cream with a marshmallow swirl and chocolate polar bears. I don't know if they just like the name or what, but it had nothing to do with Baked Alaska. This flavor, however, is all Baked Alaska. Baked Alaska is a uh, dessert with like an ice cream cake thing, and there's meringue in it. Hey guys, Eric here. Today I learned that I'm an uneducated savage, and I've been pronouncing meringue wrong for pretty much my entire life. This flavor is vanilla bean ice cream with crunchy meringue pieces. Uh, yeah, no idea why I pronounced it correctly there. Fresh strawberries, moist cake pieces, and soft meringue swirls. What in the hell? You got a little soft mixed in, you got hard mixed in, you got a lot of good stuff going on in there. Um, I love fruity ice creams, so I'm looking forward to this. Let's get to it. First spoonful coming up, not the most interesting first scoop I've ever had, but let's see what that taste is like. So it's kind of, it's it's very fruity. I, I, I like it, but um, I'm gonna keep delving in here, seeing what's what. I believe that is, if you can see it very faintly, the merengue, uh, it's, it's crunchy, so. Adds a little texture in there. You know, between the horrible mispronunciations and the talking with my mouth full, I'm just embarrassed. I'm a disgusting savage. Yeah, so there's a merengue swirl and crunchy merengue pieces in here. Visually, it's tough to discern between everything because it's all very light colored. Plus I'm colorblind, so that doesn't help things. Now you see what I mean about how it looks. I would love to show you guys more spoonfuls, but really it's hard to know when you're getting something. You taste it, it's just hard to see. If you look right there, you can see the merengue pieces. I'm not sure if you can see the merengue swirl. I certainly can't, but like I said, I'm colorblind. Don't make fun of me. So this is probably one of the more boring reviews I've ever done, but at least it'll be a short one. This ice cream is just kind of there. It's a middle of the road flavor and certainly not a standout in New Orleans Ice Cream Company's lineup. I give this one a six out of 10 and if you're ever on ice cream stores and you're ordering a bunch of flavors from New Orleans Ice Cream Company, I think this one is uh, very skippable. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.